Across Kansas, a wave of fear and uncertainty has gripped schools, parents, and students. The culprit? A surge in social media threats targeting educational institutions. The very foundation of our education system, the safety and well-being of our students, is at stake. The quiet town of Newton, Kansas, became the latest community to confront this growing menace. Late Tuesday night, a social media threat targeting Newton schools sent shockwaves through the community. Extra officers were deployed to all Newton schools, providing a visible presence intended to reassure anxious students and staff. In the face of this digital threat, investigators in Newton found themselves on the front lines of a new kind of battleground the vast and often murky world of social media. Cybersecurity experts joined forces with local law enforcement. Their combined expertise focused on tracing the origins of the threat. Sophisticated software and investigative techniques allow law enforcement to pierce the veil of online secrecy, tracking IP addresses, analyzing digital footprints, and ultimately bringing those responsible to justice. As the investigation progressed, a sense of urgency gripped the community. The Newton School District, committed to transparency, provided regular updates to parents, students, and staff. The community, too, played a vital role, with residents coming forward to share information and report any suspicious activity. Fear and uncertainty, the impact on Newton's students and parents. The social media threat sent ripples of fear and uncertainty through the classrooms and hallways of Newton schools. Parents, too, found themselves grappling with a mix of emotions, fear for their children's safety, anger at the perpetrators, and frustration over the perceived lack of control in the digital age. From Colorado to Kansas, the spread of a digital threat. The threat, it turned out, was not an isolated incident confined to the borders of their small Kansas town. The case underscored the growing need for collaboration and information sharing among law enforcement agencies across state lines. A community on Edge Garden City responds to online dangers. The ripple effect of the social media threat originating in Colorado soon reached the heart of Garden City, Kansas. Despite the initial alarm, the investigation in Garden City yielded a sense of relief. Section 3. No Place to Hide. The Long Arm of the Law in the Digital Age. The social media threats that rocked communities across Kansas served as a stark reminder of the evolving landscape of crime and punishment in the digital age. The message is clear. The long arm of the law extends into the digital realm. Section 1. Dodge City on high alert. Snapchat threats target middle schools. The wave of social media threats that swept across Kansas reached Dodge City, casting a shadow of unease over the community. The Dodge City Police Department, recognizing the gravity of the situation, sprang into action, launching a full-scale investigation. Section 2. The investigation intensifies. The Dodge City Police Department takes action. The Dodge City Police Department, faced with the daunting task of investigating threats made on a platform designed for ephemerality, adopted a multi-pronged approach. The DCPD's commitment to a thorough and transparent investigation, coupled with their proactive engagement with the community, served as a model for law enforcement agencies across the country grappling with the growing threat of online crimes. Section 3, a community united, standing together against online threats. The social media threats that targeted Dodge City's middle schools, while unsettling and disruptive, ultimately served as a catalyst for unity and resilience within the community. Parents, educators, law enforcement, and students came together, united in their determination to ensure the safety and well-being of their children and to send a clear message that threats, whether delivered in person or through the digital ether, would not be tolerated. School officials, working in close coordination with the DCPD, took proactive measures to enhance security at the targeted schools, increasing police presence, conducting security assessments, and reviewing emergency protocols. These measures, while disruptive in the short term, 
provided a sense of reassurance to anxious parents and students, demonstrating a commitment to safety and a willingness to adapt to the evolving landscape of threats in the digital age. Parents, recognizing their crucial role in keeping their children safe online, engaged in conversations about responsible social media use, the importance of reporting suspicious activity, and the potential consequences of online threats. These conversations, often difficult and uncomfortable, highlighted the need for open communication, parental involvement, and a shared understanding of the digital world that children inhabit. The events in Dodge City underscored the importance of community resilience in the face of online threats. By working together, communicating openly, and refusing to be defined by fear, communities can create a safer and more secure environment for their children both online and offline. The message is clear. Threats will not divide us, but rather strengthen our resolve to stand united in the face of adversity. Section 1. A Shared Responsibility, Parents, Schools and Law Enforcement Unite. The recent wave of social media threats targeting Kansas schools has underscored the critical importance of a collaborative approach to school safety. Parents, schools and law enforcement agencies must work together, sharing information, coordinating efforts, and presenting a united front to deter threats and ensure a safe learning environment for all students. This shared responsibility is not simply a matter of policy, it is a fundamental commitment to the well-being of our children and the future of our communities. Parents play a vital role in this collaborative effort. They are the first line of defense in keeping their children safe online, monitoring their social media activity, engaging in open and honest conversations about responsible online behavior, and reporting any suspicious activity to school officials or law enforcement. This requires parents to be aware of the social media platforms their children use, understand the potential risks involved, and stay informed about emerging trends in cyberbullying and online threats. Schools, too, have a crucial role to play. They must provide students with the knowledge and skills they need to navigate the digital world safely and responsibly, incorporating cyber awareness and digital citizenship into the curriculum. This includes educating students about the potential consequences of online threats, promoting responsible social media use, and encouraging them to report any suspicious activity to a trusted adult. Law enforcement agencies provide an essential layer of protection, investigating threats, apprehending those responsible, and working to deter future incidents. This requires close collaboration with schools and parents, sharing information, coordinating responses, and providing support and guidance. The message is clear. Threats to school safety will not be tolerated, and those who engage in such behavior will be held accountable for their actions. Section 2. Empowering Students. The Importance of Cyber Awareness and Digital Citizenship. In today's digital age, where social media plays an increasingly prominent role in the lives of young people, it is more important than ever to empower students with the knowledge and skills they need to navigate the online world safely and responsibly. Cyber awareness and digital citizenship are no longer optional extras. They are essential life skills that must be integrated into the fabric of education, equipping students to become responsible digital citizens. Cyber awareness education should begin at an early age, teaching children about the potential risks of the internet, the importance of online safety, and the responsible use of social media. As students progress through school, this education should evolve to address more complex issues such as cyberbullying, online predators, and the potential legal consequences of online threats and harassment. Digital citizenship encompasses a broader set of skills and behaviors, focusing on the ethical, responsible, and respectful use of technology. This includes understanding one's digital footprint, respecting intellectual property rights, and engaging in civil online discourse. By fostering a culture of digital citizenship, schools can create a more positive and productive online environment for all students. Empowering students through cyber awareness and digital citizenship education is an investment in their future, equipping them with the skills and knowledge they need to thrive in an increasingly digital world. By integrating these concepts into the curriculum, schools can help students develop critical thinking skills, make informed decisions, and become responsible digital citizens who contribute positively to the online community. Section 3. Building Trust Through Communication 
Transparency and open dialogue, clear, accurate, and timely communication is essential for schools and law enforcement. Transparency and open dialogue build trust, dispel rumors, and ensure informed decisions. Silence breeds fear and mistrust, undermining security. Schools need clear protocols for communicating during threats. Use various channels like email, text, and social media for timely updates. Communications should be factual, objective, and reassuring. Law enforcement must provide regular updates and safety guidance. Clear, concise, and consistent communication is key. Commitment to transparency and open dialogue fosters a safer community. Open communication creates a resilient community ready for digital age challenges. Staying ahead of the curve proactive measures and ongoing vigilance. Addressing the challenge of social media threats requires more than just reacting to incidents as they occur. It demands a proactive approach that emphasizes prevention, preparedness, and ongoing vigilance. Schools, law enforcement agencies, and communities must work together to create a culture of safety and responsibility, both online and offline, fostering an environment where threats are less likely to occur and where students feel empowered to speak out if they see something, say something. Proactive measures include implementing robust social media monitoring systems to identify potential threats early on, providing students with the skills and resources they need to navigate the digital world safely and responsibly, and fostering strong relationships between schools, law enforcement, and the community. This requires a commitment to ongoing training, resource allocation, and a willingness to adapt to the ever-evolving landscape of social media and online threats. Ongoing vigilance involves remaining alert to potential warning signs, reporting suspicious activity to the appropriate authorities, and fostering a culture where students feel comfortable coming forward with their concerns. This requires creating a safe and supportive environment where students feel heard, respected, and believed, and where they understand the importance of speaking out against bullying, harassment, and threats, both online and offline. Staying ahead of the curve in the fight against social media threats requires a sustained and collaborative effort, a commitment to continuous improvement, and a willingness to adapt to the ever-changing digital landscape. By embracing proactive measures, fostering ongoing vigilance, and working together as a community, we can create a safer and more secure learning environment for all students. Navigating the complexities of online threats, the recent surge of social media threats targeting Kansas schools has yielded valuable lessons about school safety in the digital age. Threats can emerge from anywhere, spread quickly, and sow fear far beyond their targets. The anonymity of the internet is proving to be an illusion as law enforcement develops sophisticated tools to track down perpetrators. The critical importance of collaboration and communication is the most important lesson learned. No single entity can address this challenge alone. It requires a united front. A shared commitment to safety and well-being is essential. Parents must be engaged in their children's online lives, and schools must provide students with the skills to navigate the digital world safely. Law enforcement needs resources to investigate threats and hold perpetrators accountable. The importance of cyber awareness and digital citizenship is highlighted. Students need to understand the consequences of their online actions and the importance of responsible social media use. They need to be empowered to become responsible digital citizens. These lessons are relevant for communities across the country. By embracing a proactive, collaborative approach, we can create a safer learning environment for all students. United for Safety, the power of community in a digital age. Social media threats targeting Kansas schools aim to sow fear, but had the opposite effect. They united parents, educators, law enforcement, and students in a shared commitment to safety. These communities showed the power of unity and the strength of the human spirit. Parents engaged in conversations about online safety and responsible social media use. They attended meetings, shared concerns, and offered support. They recognized children's safety as a shared responsibility. Educators incorporated cyber awareness into their lessons. They created a safe learning environment and supported students' well-being. Law enforcement built trust with the community. They provided updates, shared information, and offered guidance. Their success depended on community cooperation and collaboration. A call to action, building a safer future for Kansas schools. 
The social media threats targeting Kansas schools remind us that safety is a collective responsibility. This is a call to action, an opportunity to come together and build a safer future for all students. Parents, you are the first line of defense in keeping your children safe online. Engage in open conversations about responsible social media use and the importance of reporting suspicious activity. Foster a relationship of trust and open communication. Educators integrate cyber awareness into your curriculum. Teach students about online safety and responsible social media use. Partner with parents and law enforcement to reinforce these messages. Work together to create a culture of safety and responsibility, both online and offline.